What's going on guys, Matt here for Red and Black TV, reporting on the result at Hoysh Park two nights ago. It was a very good game, I've got to give you um, Bournemouth that. Fielded a completely different side that I was expecting, a more stronger side looking, but with well, once again with youngsters on the bench. But fielding a lot of first team options and coming away with a 3-1 victory over the Glovers. Very good goals, but once again, I'm going to say this again. Not to discredit Benick. Benick is firing left, right and centre. He's always in the right place. He's a very good goal, goal poacher. Always there. So if there is a mistake or in the right place at the right time and we'll pull it in the back end net. However, whatever the kind of style of the goal is. But that's not one thing. If it That's where I think Benick is the best for and needs to be alongside another striker who's really good at just firing home, like Jermaine Defoe or um, Josh King, and that's where he has been all this season, Benek Fove, and that's why he hasn't always got the most amount of goals and has received a lot of criticism from his goals. Still, Benek Fove firing two, and once again, Lee Smuzet firing home. He's He's been on fire recently. He's, he's really shown that he really wants to break into that first team. There's going to be a lot of choices for striker options for next season as his goal came from in the first half to equalise against Yeovil after going 1-0 down. Chasing after the ball, getting just before the goalkeeper and chipping it over the goalkeeper to fire Bournemouth into a equalisation. The next goal came from a corner ball whipped in from Ryan Fraser. Header right at the goalie. Goalie spells. And like I said, there's Ben Bobe to just get it and knock it past the goalkeeper after a very fatal error from the oval goalie to make it 2-1. Going into the second half, uh, really good 1-2 football. Interception by Yeovil. Clearing out very messily to Andrew Sermon. Finding Mark Pugh. Going down. Got bringing the goalie out a bit from his goal. Cutting it across to find Benek Fove, who slots it in nice and easy to make a three goals to one. And a victory for another win at pre-season. Absolutely incredible. we got Napoli up next. And it's going to be very interesting, really. Federici, I'm going to talk about. I don't feel like he's, he's, he's someone who I think we need to ship off now. He's going to have struggles. I, I really do. I don't think he's going to get in, and I think we really need to give Aaron Ramsdale a chance, because after that World Cup win, showing he could be a very good goalkeeper for the future, and maybe sell Federici on, I don't know how much for and what to see, maybe to like a championship side. Barbie Matt from Running Back TV, it's been 3-1 against Yeovil. If you want to watch more Ball for Lake content, subscribe down to the channel. I've been Matt, and I'm out.